Welcome everyone to our Divine Mercy Chaplet for today. I'm Father Michael Slovak. Hope everyone is doing well. I am uh, about to leave to get to, uh, let's see, to get to Dunseith for the Saturday Vigil Mass for today. Um, it's kind of amazing to me. I have had no trouble whatsoever doing my Divine Mercy and Rosaries until the last three days. And I have a theory that it has to do with me going home, that the closer I get to going home, the crazier and the more stuff I'm trying to do. But um, long story short, uh, yet again, this will probably, there. I don't think I'll be able to do a rosary. And I'm so, so sorry, um, but I... I have to be in the confessional at 4.30. And so once we're done with this, I'll have basically an hour to drive to Dunseith and to finish my homily and to start the streaming before, before, uh, ooh, before um, I have to be in the confessional. So I'm happy that I can do the Divine Mercy with you. I, I, it would take a lot to keep me from the Divine Mercy. It's a 15 minute devotion. And yet it's just so powerful. And as, as I always like to point out, doing it at three o'clock is even is just awesome. And so I know a lot of priests that have their watch set for three o'clock. And as soon as their watch goes off, they disappear from three to four just to be close to God. And so I'm so happy that I can do that for all of you to say this uh, divine mercy and to pull you into prayer with me at three o'clock. I'm sorry, we've been missing the rosary. But something tells me after Monday, after I get back to Texas, it won't be a problem anymore. But until then, I think it might just keep getting worse. <laughs> I got a lot to back in before I leave on Monday. So thank you, everyone. And let's go ahead and begin our Divine Mercy Chaplet for today. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Heavenly Father, we come to before you asking for your protection, asking for your help, your strength, your peace and love, and especially asking for your divine mercy, which our Lord won for us on the cross, that opens the gates of heaven and helps us, helps us by forgiving all of our sins. We ask this for ourselves, our loved ones, our families, our communities, our nation, and our world. You expired, Jesus, but the source of life gushed forth for souls. The ocean of mercy opened up for the whole world. O font of life, unfathomable divine mercy, envelop the whole world and empty yourself out upon us. O blood and water which gush forth from the heart of Jesus, as a font of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water which gush forth from the heart of Jesus, as a font of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water, which gush forth from the heart of Jesus, as a font of mercy for us, I trust in you. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who is conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, he rose from the dead, ascended to heaven, and sits at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Eternal Father, we offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity, your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, 
and atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, we offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. The second decade. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, we offer you the body and blood soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. The third decade. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, we offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. The fourth decade. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, we offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins 
and those of the whole world. The fifth and final decade. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal God, in whom mercy is endless and the treasury of compassion inexhaustible, look kindly upon us and increase your mercy in us, that in difficult moments we might not despair nor become despondent, but with great confidence submit ourselves to your holy will, which is love and mercy itself. Amen. Jesus, I trust in you. Jesus, I trust in you. Jesus, I trust in you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. And so um, my apologies to everyone. Today is the third day in a row I won't be able to do the rosary with you. Today um, I have a little more than an hour before I've got to be in confession. And I am still in Belcourt. i got to get to Dunseith, finish a homily, and set up the streaming. So you will be able to watch the Mass at 5 o'clock. So um, I try not to do this while I'm driving, unless someone else is driving, and that hasn't, doesn't happen very often. So um, I'm so happy that I got to do the Divine Mercy with you, to share this hour of mercy with you. Please pray for me as I head to Dunseith to uh, start the Masses, the Dunseith Weekend Masses. And um, some exciting news that everyone's going to find out this weekend our bishop in North Dakota has uh, done two things which bring great joy to my heart. One, he has uh, reopened the singing. So we could have choirs, but nobody could sing along with them. And it meant that we couldn't sing the mass parts. That has been restored. So those in Dunseith will get to hear the Alleluia sung this weekend. And um, secondly, the holy water fonts are back. So the bishop is letting holy water be at the entrances again. So two beautiful things. Uh, I'm still looking forward to when he lets us back into the regular confessionals that are that. Well, we're in he ha, ha, we're in bigger confessionals with more airflow because of COVID. But I can't wait to get back to the old one. But I'll take it. <laughs> we'll be singing at mass tonight and tomorrow, and from now on again until we hear otherwise. And we've got our holy water back. So thanks be to God for, for these joys. And prayers to everybody else who don't have these joys, they're coming. There's a lot of good things happening. And uh, I pray that this crisis will be completely, will be over soon. So thank you, everyone. I will see you at Mass. The Lord be with you. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. And I don't leave until around 3 or 4 p.m. on Monday. So I still got a day and a half to survive. <laughs> I won't rest until I get onto that plane for Texas. So God bless you all. Keep praying for me. <laughs>